actually insane. So far, this has made $5,000 in a single day. And bro, like I can't find a single person talking about this on YouTube. Hey, everybody, listen. Today, I'm going to be talking about a method where you can sell a digital product. And this method is so untapped. Like, bro, I dare you right now to go on YouTube and try to see if there's someone even talking about this. Now, look, I sold digital products in the past, but like I only made like a few thousand. So not much because the methods I was using, they were basically like churn and burn type of methods. But with this one, you don't have to show your face. You don't have to make videos. You don't even have to do ads on this one. And best of all, like you're not going to be banned. Like no, no bans on this. <laughs> but anyway, before I'll show you the whole thing, I just need to, I just need to hammer something in your brain. So affirm with me, everything, everything for me is easy. Listen, most of you guys always go into something thinking that it's so hard. And then when something is easy, you're like, nah, -uh, this ain't supposed to be easy. I'm, I'm used to hard. Show me the hard stuff. And then you go and start overcomplicating everything like a dumb dumb. Bro, that's why there's people who are dumber than you with lower IQ than you and have more money than you because they don't overthink. So again, affirm with me. Everything for me is easy. Anyway, so let's get started. <laughs> So we're gonna be actually selling a digital product, right? So it's not like dropshipping or affiliate marketing. No, we're gonna be selling a digital product, which means we gotta be good at one thing. And that thing is copywriting. Now listen, that's not my method, by the way. I still haven't showed you. But what's copywriting? So in copywriting, you're gonna be spending 50% of your time just doing research, 30% of your time finding the idea, and then 20% of it actually doing the whole writing. So don't be scared. You're not gonna be writing as much. So we're gonna be starting actually first with research. So look, first you wanna be picking a specific person you wanna sell to. And I mean specific. Don't just be selling to women who want to look good or to men who want to make money. No, I'm saying specific, bro. So for example, you can sell to a 40 year old Christian woman who is divorced but has two kids and uh, she feels like her time is just running out. Or you can sell to the accountant who just has like this fear that AI is going to replace him. Or you can sell to a dropshipper who literally watched every single TikTok dropshipping video on YouTube, but still he can't, he can't seem to get results. So you see, it's like, it's a very specific person. And in my opinion, actually, bro, the best specific person that you can actually sell to is you from the past. Remember you? <laughs> and then here's why. So look, there's this idea that's so true and it's that there's no one actually around us is special. Everyone thinks they're special, but there's no one that's actually special. So the problems that you faced in the past, most likely someone else has also faced those problems. And yeah, like I'm talking like even the deep ones, like the deep ones. So if you're still feeling guilty about stealing the M&M from the convenience store when you were eight, it's okay, bro. I've been there too. And I'm pretty sure I'm not the only one, right? Right? <laughs> So that means whatever problem you actually faced in the past, if you've solved it, you can actually just come and make a product about it. And people are actually gonna buy it because they have that problem too. So let me show you a quick example. So I made my first $10,000 to dropshipping, but then a few months later, I ended up with zero dollars. And then after like so many testing and so many stores and all that stuff, I just couldn't seem to find success. Everything I was doing, turned out to be a failure. So eventually I actually got to zero and then I just got into more debt. So it wasn't until after I started learning about this skill called copywriting, is when I actually started to find more success in my dropshipping career. Career. <laughs> so now I can literally create a whole program that teaches people copywriting and how they can use it for dropshipping. And the beautiful thing is that I'm actually doing that with you right now on YouTube, except that there's not an actual program. It's just a bunch of videos that help you. So I haven't made an actual product, but just know, bro, if I make a product like a course, it's going to freaking destroy all of YouTube. So if you actually struggled with anything in the past, bro, that's, that's good. That means you can make a product out of it. And then what's nice is that you'll actually be able to sell it very properly too. So let's just say in the past, you were actually like a, like a beta male. And then anytime, you tried to talk to girls, your face, bro, your, your face would just turn red. So it wasn't until you discovered how to increase your testosterone that all of a sudden you stopped feeling this way and then you became more confident and then whatever you wanted, you just go and get it. What was beautiful is that now you can actually make an ebook that teaches people how to go from beta to epsilon or whatever, whatever the term is. So do you get the idea, bro? Your problems, your problems are gold. Like they've been put in your life for a reason. So use them. Now let's say you have a problem, but you haven't solved it yet. It doesn't matter, bro. You know what the solution is. You're just being a dumb dumb and you're not f doing the solution. So make sure you do it, fix the problem. And then what's gonna happen is just that it's gonna become like a win, 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 win. Just wins everywhere. Anyway, so that's step number one. Basically find your specific person and think of a product to create for them based on the problems that they have, okay? Now, the second thing you wanna do is basically create a big idea to the point where if your target market, your specific person saw the idea, their mouth would just start drooling. And then it's like, why, why do you need like a big idea? Because look, bro, without the big idea, 
you're not really going to get their attention and make them actually pay attention to you. So let me show you an example of things that are actually working right now that are doing this exact method. And honestly, bro, they're making pretty good money with this. All right, look, so the whole method is actually going to be on this weird app called Twitter that I'm pretty sure you've heard of. So let me show you a few examples of people doing the thing that I want to show you. And they're making very good money on this. So for example, this guy right here, his name is Breathe Less. So their entire big idea is that you should be breathing less. And if you want to become healthy and like very good in terms of health, just breathe less. So that's the big idea. So he says that he suffocates people until they get healthy. And then if you just go on their actual website that they're trying to sell the product in, basically they're using Gumroad and you can use anything that you want. In this case, they're just using Gumroad. So you can read their entire sales letter and all that stuff. And they're selling it for $18. Now, honestly, bro, I don't know how many sales they have, but just judging from the amount of followers they have, like definitely he's made at least $10,000 just from literally just from this one product right here. So this right here is just one example. Another example is actually this guy. His name is Ruby, his actual name. This guy is freaking insane. So none of these people, by the way, they actually show their faces. All they do is just come here and just tweet, tweet, tweet. That's all they do is just tweet. But then if you see this one, he has 127,000 followers. And what he's selling is this program called Terminate, which is a subconscious programming audio. So if you just listen to this, basically it's going to reprogram your mind and turn you into like this thing that is unstoppable. And honestly, bro, he's making very good money because think about this. He has 605 ratings, like reviews. So that literally means at least 2000 people actually bought his audio program and he's selling it for 33 pounds. So if we do the math, which by the way, whatever math I do is going to be way more than what he actually has made. So he's definitely made minimum 60,000 pounds so far. But Ruby, if you're watching this, I'm pretty sure you made more than that, bro. So no disrespect. <laughs> but then this last person, which is actually my favorite. And the reason why this, this person is actually my favorite is because they only have 1000 followers and their name is Top Shelf Grind. But if you go on their website, it's actually a Shopify website and he's not selling like a digital product. But what you can see is that he's making $5,000 a day. So I literally stocked this entire Shopify store for a whole day. And it's funny because while I started recording, he even got more sales. So what he's actually doing is just selling things like, like things like coffee. Like it's just coffee or just supplements or whatever. So mushroom coffee, uh, diamond hands coffee, waste lost coffee, liquid gold. It's just coffee stuff. And he's making $5,000 a day in revenue. So if he's making that like in, in revenue a day, so you could just say his, his profit is at least 20% margins. So $5,000, 20% margins, like minimum he's making $1,000 a day. So $30,000 a month. So this is the thing. This is why I truly think this entire like side hustle, it's not even a side hustle. This entire business model is so crazy. Who talks about on YouTube using Twitter to send traffic to your website and get more sales? Like people actually talking about how to truly use Twitter to get more sales. That's insane. Most people just talk about TikTok organic and then obviously Pinterest. I talked about Pinterest before, or even Facebook, but no one is really talking about Twitter. And the reason why this is crazy is because their name is just top shelf grind. And their big idea is that member think and grow rich. So they're saying drink, and grow rich. So all of these people are in the finance niche or the money niche or just the self-development niche. But like, as you can see, he's basically just selling energy, like just selling energy. And then if you go down, you can see like all of their tweets, they actually provide value. Like he's telling you what supplements to take if you have, if you're trying to target whatever organ in your body. And then every once in a while, they just start tweeting like this where it doesn't really provide any value, but it just shows like, I know my exact target market and I know what they want. So let me just basically give them what they want. Like a few dopamine, dopamine boosters. This guy's not even showing his face. He's not even making any videos. All he's doing is just writing. That's it. Now, what you can do with this method is, is endless. So for example, this guy is just selling literally physical products like these, but then it's like this guy is selling a, a digital product and he's just selling how to actually breathe better. And then this guy is just selling an audio program that basically re reprograms your mind. So I just showed you three different products and how these people are making money from Twitter. Such an untapped method, bro. Now, how do you actually do this whole thing? Well, the first thing you got to do is remember the person that we tried to sell to the specific person, which is your past two. You want to basically create a product that actually sells to them. So whatever problem they faced, you want to come and just basically fix that problem for them. Now, for example, if we were looking at this whole breathe less walking product, so this right here is what he's selling. So he's basically saying all chronic pain, suffering and disease is caused from a lack of oxygen at the cellular level, which basically just says, if you just listen to me, bro, I'll show you how to basically be disease free. So now if you look right here, you want to basically fill all of these things out. Now in copywriting, this is actually top. So even if you're doing dropshipping, even if you're doing whatever, you want to basically fill all of these things out. So it's like, like think about what is the actual problem that you're trying to sell. So let's do this live right now. So the very first thing I want to extract from this is basically like, what's the big idea? So the big idea after reading this whole thing is just basically breathing less is better. Now, 
The reason why this is a big idea is because, well, maybe not better, maybe you can say healthier. Again, the reason why this is a big idea is because if you hear just someone saying that if you breathe less, it's a lot healthier for you, the very first thing that comes to your brain is, what the heck are you freaking talking about, bro? It's something that basically interrupts your pattern. It's like, what are you talking about? I thought breathing more is actually healthier for you. So this guy comes and he's like, no, breathing less is healthier for you. Now let me show you why. Now without a big idea, you won't really catch the attention of your customer. So you need to have something that basically interrupts their pattern. And in this case, it's something like this, which is breathing less is healthier. And then it's like, what's the promise? Well, the promise is unlimited energy, no disease, increased libido. And then it's like, what's the actual problem that the person was facing? Well, it's just no energy, bro. Just have no energy and then for the mechanism so this is actually important so you got to have like a unique mechanism that's a bit different from everyone else and i was like what's the actual mechanism with this person well as you can see it's called the buteco method now usually the mechanism is just like it's just like the method it's just like the secret ingredient behind why your program works and in this case it's just the buteco method now it's like what's the buteco method i have no freaking idea it's just some method that he's he probably came up with i don't know and then for the proof usually proof is always going to be the same thing so it's either going to be like a demonstration. So you just want to demonstrate what the actual method is to people. So in this case, he's like, there's five categories. And then he's like CP less than 20 seconds and a CP between this, this and that. So he's literally demonstrating what the actual method is to people. So that's one form of proof. Another form of proof is basically he was like, it was discovered by Dr. Buteco. So you could say another thing is basically using authority. So in this case, he was using the authority of a doctor. And then the second thing he was saying that there's like a, he was saying there's like 1000 people that we've tested this whole method on. So it's just social proof. And again, usually your proof is always going to be the same thing. So it's always going to be like demonstration, authority, social proof, literally anything along the lines. And it's actually not that hard to get stuff like this. So you basically combine all of these elements together and you should be able to get a product like the one that he got. Now, in your case, you want to basically be building these things backwards. So we filled out these things based on the product that he has, but you want to start off backwards. Let me, so let me basically do one with you live. Let's say, let's just say we're selling to a dropshipper who watched just a bunch of YouTube videos and he still doesn't have results. So the problem is what? No results, even after watching a bunch of YouTube videos. And then it's like, okay, what's the promise that we're going to be giving to them? Well, usually the promise is the opposite of the problem. So the promise, you'll get to make $1,000 a day. So the proof is going to be showing how I made $1,000 a day, or basically giving free value. And in this case, is going to be demonstration, or basically social proof, which is basically just showing other people that they have basically taken the same stuff I teach them, and they're getting results with it. So that's basically social proof for you. So again, it's going to be always the same thing. So a demonstration, authority, or just social proof. And then the big idea, you could say something like, the real reason why you're not successful is because of this secret skill which is copywriting or you could say it's because of the skill that no guru talks about and then the mechanism is going to be something like a method which in my case could actually be something like the halal method now the reason why I want, the halal method i think is actually pretty good is because i know my specific person is as a Muslim, and if they hear about the halal method, they're gonna be like, yeah, bro, tell me about that. Now, I know not every one of you guys is Muslim, obviously, but I'm just saying like the specific, specific person could be that. And the reason why this would work is because they're gonna be like, well, okay, everyone else is basically teaching the haram method. So I wanna learn the halal method, which by the way, is just, instead of just dropshipping, you would have like a 3PL where you have like your own product. So the reason why I think if you just combine all of these, then they're gonna be successful, is just because this is different. This is not like the same as anyone else has showed. Who on YouTube, talks about the halal method to do dropshipping. It's crazy. And just making $1,000 a day with the halal method. It's just crazy. So you take all of these things and then you put them in the blender and then you'll be able to create a product like, like this. Now let's say you made your product. Well, now you just gotta go and start tweeting. So the tweeting part is actually not that hard, bro. You basically just wanna mention the problem right here. So modern people breathe incorrectly and then mention the big idea. So in this case, this guy suffocates people until they get healthy. So it basically teaches them the right way to breathe, which is just breathing less. And then the way to write tweets, I can't really make an entire video on how to write tweets because it's gonna take way too long. So what you do is basically go and see how these people are tweeting and tweet the same way as them. For example, how this guy does it is he he basically breaks out his, his words. Like he's like, if you want to, and then he puts the words here, and then he puts the words here, and then here. He doesn't just put them in like one paragraph where it looks so freaking annoying to the eye to you, to you to read. It's like now you can just tweet about whatever you want as long as it gives people value and as long as like it has like a big idea within it. And then from here, you can just write whatever tweets you want, bro. Like for example, look at this. Like he's literally tweeting about <laughs> Kim Jong-un. <laughs> so it doesn't matter. You're literally gonna also like have fun with this entire method, which is pretty cool. Now, for example, if we just look at this guy's tweets, which his big idea, by the way, is drink and grow rich, which you could say is also the premise. It's like, if you just look at it, 
he's he's adding value. The best supplements to protect each organ, and then he gives you the exact supplements. So like, why would he write a tweet like this? Well, because he knows that his market loves reading things like these. And then he basically got an image just like this one, which you can just easily, easily go and get this from Mid Journey. And then he wrote like another tweet that says the only stack you need for whatever blood flow. And he talks about all these things. Well, it's like, why is he talking about all these things? Because once again, he realized if I talk about supplements or things that people can just ingest and then they'll get like an immediate benefit. Well, if I talk about that, I'm going to get views because people like that. And then, for example, he's like 90% of testosterone boosters are, are not good. And then you can even lower your testosterone if you take them. But here's the ones that I think are good. See, it's like just the way you write, bro. Like he could have just said these are the best testosterone supplements. But he's like, no, 90% of them are bad. Here are the good ones. So you're just going to need to learn like how to actually get people's attention. And it's like in this case, like this whole thing. It's just pure copywriting. Like you're only going to be limited to your words and maybe even sometimes picture to actually get the attention of the person you're trying to get their attention of. So what you're going to have to do is whatever specific person you pick. Remember from the beginning of the video, you picked a specific person, you're past you, take that person and then go on Twitter and then basically try to find the top pages that are talking to this person and then see what they're tweeting about. And then all you're going to have to do is just come and then make similar tweets as them, but just a bit better. And by the way, like just so you know, most, most tweets on Twitter are recycled. Nothing is actually original. Like for example, this thing right here, like do you think he's the first one that talked about Tongat Ali or Shilajit to increase your testosterone? No, he's not the first one, bro. A lot of people talked about that, but he just comes and basically tries to put like a twist on it. And the twist in this case is he says that 90% of testosterone boosters are not good for you. And then once again, you could pretty much see that this guy has found the formula. 250,000 views, which is insane. Supplements nearly everyone should be taking. And it's like just all of these things. This guy literally just found the formula for like to grow super fast just find one thing that's working and then just keep doing like keep recycling it and once again bro you're only using words in this case you're not making freaking videos you're not like making pictures and all that stuff just words so once again to do this make sure you fill out the problem the promise the mechanism all that stuff and then put all of these in a blender and find out what the name of the product is supposed to be in this case he's like breathe less walking breathe less because that's the entire big idea and walking because that's within the method or it's like this guy terminate which is basically becoming unstoppable subconscious reprogramming which is the entire big idea which is just an audio that reprograms your mind to make you unstoppable and then what you can do is use either gumroad use like wap.com use freaking even shopify just use anything it literally doesn't matter what you use but the entire idea is you use this thing which is not kim jong-un but you use twitter just gotta use Twitter. Twitter is so freaking untapped, bro. And by the way, just to show you, look at this guy right here. His name is Van Man. If you just click on his website right here, which is basically a Shopify website, you can see exactly what he's selling. Tooth powder or like honey balm or honey balm number two for $100. It's freaking insane. Or like magnesium deodorant and all that stuff. And while I was here, he actually just got a sale. This is insane. Twitter, bro. Twitter is so untapped. Even for e-commerce. Like it's not just about digital products. Even for like... Physical products, bro. Now, yes, he is selling custom-made products, but who's stopping you from doing the same thing? Or even just another example, look at this guy. So, Carnivore Aurelius, which is one of the biggest ones, by the way, on Twitter. If you just click on his website, again, it's another Shopify website, and he's selling beef liver crisps. So, as you can see, they're all custom-made products, but it's still fine. And now, what's beautiful about this one is this guy went, like, super hard on the copywriting. So, as you can see, his whole website is just copy. Like, just copy, copy, copywriting, words, words, words. It's all just copywriting, which is... It's just beautiful. It just shows you that this whole thing works, but it's like no one's actually doing it just because they think Twitter people, they don't buy. Bro, Twitter people, they buy. So you'll just need a big idea that basically interrupts everyone's pattern and you'll do good with this. You'll do good. So I hope this video was helpful. I hope like it opened your mind to let you know that the internet, bro, the internet is still untapped. It's not just about TikTok organic or like Shopify and all that stuff. It's not just about that, bro. There's so many things, like so many ways to make money. So don't, don't like, don't limit yourself, bro. Don't limit yourself.